Hello my dear friend, welcome back, uh, I am David Cortez and this is my website www.david-cortez.com In this video I'm going to talk about the data structure if so if is a specialized binary tree based data structure that satisfies the if property. In a max if for a given node, the value of that node is greater than or equal to the values of its children. And in a min if, the value of any node is less than or equal to the values of its children. Ips are complete binary trees, meaning that all levels of the tree are fully filled, except possibly the last, which is filled from left to right. So there are two types of ips, the max ip, so the key at a parent node is greater than or equal to the keys of its children, and the min ip, the key at a parent node is less than or equal to the keys of its children. So in a max ip you find, for example, 10 with the two uh, with the two children that are uh, uh, 7 and for example 8 in a mini you find 4 as parent and then you find uh, uh, 7 and 8 so it is a max ip it is a min ip so max if the key at a parent node is greater than or equal to the keys of its children, min if the key at a parent node is less than or equal to the keys of its children. So it, it is very important. Use of if. Ifs are widely used in algorithms for uh, tasks like uh, priority queues, if sort graph algorithms, memory allocation. Priority queues, ifs are used to implement priority queues where elements with higher priority are served before elements with lower priority. Ipsort, a comparison based sorting algorithm that uses a if data structure. Graph algorithms, uh, dice tra shortest path and prints uh, minimum spanning tree use ips. Memory allocation in dynamic in dynamic memory management, the term ip also refers to a region of memory where dynamic memory allocation takes place. However, this is conceptually different from the ip data structure, so it is important. Example of a max heap in C. Here is a basic implementation of a max heap in C. You can find here the code. So there is the function to insert an element into the max heap. Then uh, there is um, a function to epify the max heap. Then there is a function to remove and return the maximum element from the max uh, if. And then there is the function to display the if. So you can copy paste this code inside the code blocks and you can try yourself. So explanation of the code. Insert adds an element uh, uh, to the heap and then ensures the max heap property by bubbling the element up to its correct position. Epify a function to maintain the max heap property by moving down an element if needed. Extract max 
removes and returns the maximum element uh, uh, root of the heap and then re-establishes the heap property. Display heap prints the current heap. Advantages of heap efficient for priority queues, insertion and deletion in heaps are efficient with the logarithmic time complexity, making heaps ideal for priority queues. Heap sort sorting using a heap, heap sort is an efficient comparison based sorting algorithm with an O n times log n times com com complexity. Memory allocation. Heaps can be used in managing dynamic memory, allowing uh, for efficient allocation and deallocation. Disadvantages of heap not suitable for search. A heap is not an efficient data structure for searching for arbitrary elements. Searching in a heap has ON complexity. Not balanced, too. Although a heap is a complete binary tree, it is not necessarily balanced, meaning operations like searching are less efficient compared to balanced binary search trees, BSTs. So, space overhead, maintaining a heap requires additional space for managing indices and pointers during the insertion and extraction process. Conclusion, in summary, heaps are crucial in optimizing certain types of problems, particularly those that involve finding the minimum or maximum efficiently, but their weakness lie in non-priority operations such as searching. So you can find this document, this PDF, on my website exactly in the um, subsection uh, software engineering you can find here data structures if on my website you can find a lot of information about software engineering web development mathematics physics chemistry you can find also games up uh, musing uh, music, uh, etc. You can uh, write me using my personal chat. So by clicking here, chat on the sidebar, you can chat with me. You must sign up using uh, your email. And uh, dear friend, your donation is important. Help me update this website and join this community. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.